morning. So another uh, another morning, and I'm once again out with the pooch you do, and we are off on adventures today. Danny's had a, a palaver with doctors this morning. He had. Uh, they've got this new system where there's no pre-booked appointments anymore. You just got to phone up and try and get one that day. And uh, she phoned up, and the woman that answered were a bit of a sarcastic cow. So that put her in a bad mood, and she wouldn't let her do more than one thing either. So she could. Danny had to phone up because she wanted to speak to the doctor about her meds. And she also needed to book an appointment with nurse to have a pill check. And it was like, you can only do one thing at a time. You would have to ring back or call in. It took her 46 attempts at ringing to get through to him in the first place. So she just went in. And then she got a pill appointment sorted, came home. And she'd been home like less than 10 minutes and the doctor rang. And because the doctor is actually a, a pretty damn good guy, he, he had her sorted in like two minutes on phone. So she's gone back to the doctors to pick up the prescription that he's filled out for her. So hopefully that's no more having to go to the doctors today. All that side of stuff's done and dealt with. <laughs> because I think she's going to explode in stress if she has to uh, do anything else. And then uh, we are off to Meadowall. I'm going into uh, Danny's work again. She's got some more stuff to hand into them. And uh, I don't think Jackie is coming anymore because I don't think she's right well, but we shall see. Um, looks like it's probably just going to be me and Danny, so you'll just have to put up with the two of us today again. No guest appearances from anybody. Other than that, I don't really know what else is happening today. Probably not a lot. I'd quite like uh, some time to just chill at some point today. This is day three of my three days off. And I kind of feel like we've been busy doing things. Apart from last night, obviously, I got to sit in and watch the football. But it feels like we've kind of been busy for my time off. So uh, an evening where I can just do fuck all and chill out and watch crap on TV. And I might even get a bit of writing done tonight. But anyway, let's, uh, let's get the dog home and go and start the day properly, shall we? Oh, the life of somebody who needs chronic pain management. <laughs> I'm confused now. Why are you confused? I feel like I've got tablets missing. You. They will be in there. That's where all the tablets have you. go. Have you, have you. Um. Confused faces! Oh, oh, she's found him. <laughs> also, before I forget, today is the 27th anniversary of the birth of my best friend. So, Lighty, happy birthday. I love you like a brother. And we will go for drinks soon, just when we are less skint. Either go for drinks or drinks here. Either way, I don't care. But, you know, when we're less skint, we will do things. But, happy birthday, sir. Hope you have a good one. And don't get too fucked up in Amsterdam, because I know you're going there this week. Behave. Enjoying your ice creams. I just spent the last 20 minutes walking around various shops trying to find a pair of those like shorts that are leggings or leggings that are shorts and apparently nowhere sells them anymore. So Danny is shit out of luck today apparently. <sighs> ah well, we're gonna head home now. So we can find the car. It is chaos up here, I don't like it. I think they're singing to you. I should totally be in a Bad Manners tribute band. I would do great at Buster Blood Vessel. Shave my head, get rid of the beard, wear vest, shorts, boots, and swear a lot and shout down a microphone. I could pull that off. Easy. Anybody want to start a Bad Manners tribute band? Get in touch. This thing's been a little shit all evening. Yes, you been a little shit, haven't you? We haven't really done a whole lot. Like, Danny went out uh, to another appointment at about two, and then kind of sat around and 
watched TV, like watching Discovery Channel basically all night because there were some really funky programs on one after another. And then we had dinner and then carried on watching crap TV. It's been basically like the perfect way to spend a day off from work doing as little as possible. And I kind of know that I said that I'd tell you what um, the big exciting news were that Danny had had today, but Danny's gone to bed. So I don't want to kind of be the one that breaks the news kind of thing, you know. I want her to be able to tell you her exciting news, so probably be doing that one tomorrow. Uh, so we've got a few other bits and pieces we need to do tomorrow because we've got no popping house. I ain't got much food in, so I imagine we're going to have to go and do things tomorrow before I go to work. But we'll see. We'll see what day brings. Oh, back to work tomorrow for me. I'm trying to think who's in. I think it might be me, Simon and Kyle tomorrow. I'm going to have to book some time off. I've got 28 days left. And that's like five and a half week. And the fuck am I going to use five and a half weeks on my holiday? <sighs> I think I'll just split it up and take like a week here and a week there. They've got to last me until like back end of March next year anyway, but it's now July. I'm not going to be able to get out in August because it's all booked off. So it's going to be like, I think, I'm thinking September, like a week, week in January, and then a fortnight at end of March, because I always try to get Danny's birthday off. So a fortnight at end of March, and then rest of it is just random days. I don't know why I'm telling you all this. I'm just waffling for no reason. <laughs> Welcome to another one of my wonderful vlogs. Yeah, I think it's uh, it's about bedtime, guys. So I'm going to call it the end of another day and the end of another video. Twitter links will go in the description as usual. Feel free to follow us. Comment, like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And other than that, thanks for watching and as usual, we'll see you tomorrow.